What's up YouTube, I'm John Wheels, and today we're gonna be hard facing an anvil. So that's the first layer of uh, 718 and that'll just help the hard facing rod stick to the uh, cast better so it's kind of building up a buffer layer so the cast 718 and then the hard facing hey john from the future here so i kind of screwed up and uh bought just any old hard facing rod i just uh got the first one i saw for a good deal uh, but it turns out it was chromium carbide uh, which develops cross-check cracking um, and that's whenever per perpendicular to the weld bead a crack develops about every inch two inches that sort of thing so that was that pinging you're about to hear um, so I'm going to show you me screwing up and um, this is what it's not supposed to look like and then I'll show you with the proper uh, welding rods um, what a nice hard facing job looks like I also spent like an hour and a half researching all different types of uh, hard facing rods. So um, I'll link some of the more handy articles I found and then I'll also link um, the type of welding rods I used. start the uh, hard
so I got some better rod. This is the uh, Forney Super Coat 600. Um, anyway, this uh, rod lays down pretty smooth. Uh, it gets a little bit of porosity in the start and stop sometimes, so you kind of have to like long arc out of the end of your weld puddle and um, kind of like a 7018 start at the beginning, a little ahead, come back, and then back forward again. Um, but overall, a uh, way smoother rod to run and um, not the hardest in the world. Definitely way better than the anvil uh, was previously, but um, still after a huge hard blow, it'll still give it a little dent. So here's how it turned out, nice and flat. That big cup grinding wheel turned out uh, great and proved really useful. So I'll link one of those in the description. But um, anyway, yeah, I have a nice, decently hard anvil. Um, let me show you what kind of rebound we got here. Oh. Decent. Um, so I'd say that's probably like... 75%. Um, anyway, uh, there you go. Thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe and leave a comment below.